Uh, speaking of which, I hear that uh, there might be some news regarding Epic Mickey. Also, I figured out the uh, if you don't move, you do actually travel along these little gravity pads. I'm not pressing anything on the analog. So yeah, I was right about these having gravity. You're, it's trying to lock you into these lanes. That's what you did there, kind of funny. The mask of peace and hope. Comes the fearless defender and hero of this town. It is me, Captain Justice. Huh? What? Now listen, you pipsqueak. I'm Captain Justice. Who were you to walk away when the bonafide hero is offering his help? Um, I'm sorry, but I really don't need any kind of hero. Bonafide or... Somebody, come quick! <sighs> What's that? Trouble? Captain Justice to the rescue! You? Oh, well, that's a shame. <laughs> okay, that is actually this... kind of rude. Maybe this job's perfect for you, Mr. Hero. What? Name your catastrophe! Those annoying monsters have turned up again over in Fruit Ball Plaza. They're all yours now, Captain J. Monsters? Don't tell me the Inverse are here. Monsters? Well, too bad. Not on my list. I didn't know bona fide heroes got to pick. But I wouldn't stand a chance of surviving uh, 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 fitting them into my schedule. Gosh, I thought you said you were Captain Justice. You can't leave those menacing things running loose. They're ruining fruit ball. Huh? Hark, do you hear that? Somebody's calling for Captain Justice's help. Unless I thought they wanted to play fruit ball. I am on my way. Sounds like this catastrophe can't wait, but uh, I'll be back here in a jiff. Oh, I'm sure you will, Captain Useless. But I don't think I'll stay here and hold my breath. I'm anything but a hero, but maybe I could help if you want. Would you? Oh, that'd be just Jim Dandy. Someone needs to trounce those fiends at Fruit Ball and keep them away from the plaza. I'll try. Not eliminate Just them. Give a holler once you're ready, and I'll explain to you how fruit ball works. See, they aren't disrupting the game. They just want to play the game. They're disrupting fruit ball by playing. Rude. Rude. You, sir, are very rude. How dare they? How dare they participate in the festival? So here's ice cream, got soy milk, rocket soda, and nebula nectar, because the only ones I've found so far were um, in Radiant Garden. I'll show off the uh, rest in the additional video later. Thanks again! We're saving our money so we can go on a big adventure! Wanna play ice cream beat? No thank you, I've already beaten it once and I think I'm kinda done. So, we could go the way he wants us to, but, uh, there's also other things to attend to, if you know what I mean. We have to go learn how to dance a beat after being knocked around in a pinball machine. Hopefully I'm able to jump well enough for this. I can't fly. So it won't be super easy yet. There are places I probably can't get to yet, but still. Yep, that's the mimic. I gotta wait for Spell Weaver to wear off. Oh, 
Oh, it actually gives you one right next to it, like a pity thunder. So zap it, hit it. Come on, transform. And go nuts. You guys really need better wiring. Replace this generator, it is broken. How come you guys keep turning it off every time I leave? So I'll just go to the pinball. Yeah, almost. I'll get Dash or Glide or whatever her equivalent is and come back. Since the only thing over there is treasure, I'll just wait till she can either Dash, Glide, or whatever her special is going to be. She gets something. Yeah, see, barely. I'd hope she'd get additional movement. Hasn't been the same for every character so far, but they do usually get something and never land. It gives them some degree of mobility. Also, I could have sworn uh, there's something else in Radiant Garden. Maybe it's in the special episode. It has to be. It's like there's a scene that I didn't get. But I finished it, so it must be later. In the special. green ones. Treasure. And see ya. Action recipe. Slam. Let's see. Uh, that's the way out. But I can still very carefully. <laughs> Please stop. Ah, there we go. Just hang ten off the ledge. No, I didn't see the thing coming down. Our new camera. There we go. Open it. There we go. We got break time for Aqua. I don't know why this is a trophy, but it exists, so. Anything special up here? Any enemies? Hello? This is where Ben's enemies are. Not for Aqua though. Yeah, because we'll need something to get over there, maybe. Maybe. I don't see any chests over there, actually. Hmm. There's one for the other two. I don't see one for her. Myself. 
could do platforming without cheating. What, is there no aqua ability? Does she not have, like, glide or dash or anything? That's gonna suck. Ah, there's chests. I didn't see any that time. I'm just hoping she gets like a little bit extra of something. Okay, since I'm obligated now. Is it? Break time. As soon as it loads. Come on. I kinda wish it wouldn't do that every single time you redo your commands. It should, shouldn't have to charge them every time. Because the only way you're able to go into the menu is if there's no enemies anyway. So, break time for Aqua. My turn. I thought it was rhythm, so I was waiting for the... Oh, that one was rhythm! That one was freaking rhythm, but we get... Majoret? I don't know how to pronounce that. Majoret? Majoret? Eh? Okay, let's try it again. My turn. Oh no, there's circles for it. It's just that it's uh, really fast and really light. Wow. But since that is functionally useless, it can go in the bin. We can get like fire dash or something with invincibility frames. Good old fruit ball. Their mm. chest first. Huh. Potion. I got the ice cream trophy. I think I've proven I'm decent enough at rhythm. It's just those were. Hard to see. You think you're ready to take out those monsters in the fruit ball court? Hit the fruit balls into your opponent's goal to score. Each fruit reacts differently when hit. Press X to shoot, square for a curve shot, triangle to bump the fruit into the air, and press X for a fast goal shot, or triangle again to smash the fruit at the opponents and stun them for a short while. Use the left stick to control the fruit's direction while shooting. This is gonna suck! I suck at fruit ball. Oops. Especially since I'm used to playing as Ben. What? Gotcha. My strategy last time was to stay as close to the fence as I could. Ball is kind of luck based too. It's just a chaotic mess. You didn't even aim it at the goal. I think that's the problem too. A lot of times it feels like you have no aim. Like sometimes it'll aim to the goal and sometimes it won't. No matter if you're directing it or not. It helped 
one too if it would pull back and I could see my own net. Usually when these go up, it's best to just guard your own spot, but... Ugh. I do not like fruit ball. I wasn't aiming at that one. Auto target. Oh, this stupid net. I hate this net. Because that happens. Come on. Let me interact with the fruit. <laughs> Same time. Oh god. Yeah, it's gonna hit that. Camera and auto target make this challenge just an absolute mess. If they turned off auto targeting for this and uh, pulled the camera back, I honestly think fruit ball would be way better. <laughs> no wonder the Unburst are so good at fruit ball since it's chaotic. Obtain bloom letter. Yeah, I, I really don't care for fruit ball one bit. Ah, uh, you sure taught those monsters a lesson. You're the real hero in town, if you ask me. He's right, my dear. I couldn't agree more. Thank you so much. I mean, it's basically volleyball, so... And she's our queen. Oh, please excuse me, your majesty. Where are my manners? My name is Aqua. There's no need to be so formal. Just call me Minnie. <sighs> you see, I'm not sure I'm doing a very good job protecting my kingdom. Oh, don't say that, Queen Minnie. We all know how hard it's been since the king set off the way he did. Don't you trouble yourself. Why, we wouldn't even think of putting on our yearly dream festival if we thought there was the slightest chance anything might go wrong. Oh, you're very kind, Horace. How about that Pete, though? Captain Justice, my high. You can't count on him for anything. Wait, you're saying his real name is Pete? Well, it sure as sugar isn't justice. Pete never does anything for anybody except Pete. That get up was just an act to get folks to vote for him. He wants to win the Million Dreams Award and hog the prize. Million Dreams Award? What is that? It's part of our dream festival. We all vote for who we think the most admirable citizen is. But Pete seems to have the wrong idea. He thinks that dressing up as a hero and proclaiming that he is one will win him votes. What really makes someone a hero isn't what they wear or what they say. It's the things they do and how they treat everyone. Well, in my book, Aqua here is number one. You got my heartfelt vote. <sighs> Thanks, Horace. I promise I'll try not to let you down. See that you don't. My vote's very important. Oh, dear. He sounds serious. <laughs> Being popular is tough. Oh, are we gonna actually see the results of this? Who do you think's gonna win this year's Million Dreams Award? For real boy! I hope it's the guy I voted for! I voted for him too! Now that we got so much business at the shop, maybe we'll be number one! Wow, Bucket's good sure would be proud of us if we actually won! Yeah, and I bet after that it would be pretty surprised too! Let's see. Hello, everyone. They for voted for Ven, so time that's to begin the main event of our dream festival. Three for Ven, two for Terra. Award presentation. And one for Aqua. <laughs> Just skip to the part where you say my name. This is a shoe in. Oh, how very exciting! 
Kevin, this year we have multiple winners. The Million Dreams Award goes to... Ventus, Aqua, and Terra. All three of you. <laughs> How is that possible? <laughs> three voted for one, two voted the, for the ben other, and one voted for and Terra. Terra. Here? What do you mean? There's gotta be a mistake. Everybody voted for Captain Justice. I made sure. Now go on, tell her. No. Better try the other one. The Rogue Racer, Captain Dark. Pete, we counted the votes very carefully. Ventus, Aqua, and Terra won! Oh, Pete, I think you tried to do something good, but you were doing it for the wrong reasons, and you went about it the wrong way. Still, a couple of citizens must have thought you had goodness in you, because you actually got a few votes. They knew you were looking out for them. Big whoop. I don't need their lousy votes. Just cough up my prize. Pete! They voted for you because they believe in you and care about you. How could you look down on that? I've tried to forgive a lot of things you've done, but this is too much. Now you finally crossed the line. Like that matters to me. Besides, what are you gonna do about it? Huh, I'm gonna let you cool off for a while. Guards! This feels like mood of the week. Also, her guards are brooms. Oh, they're the Fantasia Wait, Brooms! Hey, let me go! Put me down! What? No, you can't! No, no, no! Hey, easy! Ow! I see Mickey taught his wife some magic. Now, shall we continue the ceremony? With the three winners, Ventus, Aqua, and Terra, Please come up and join me on the stage. I feel like maybe this is one of those scenes where it's supposed to have a ton of NPCs that voted, oh, but the PSP dear. just didn't it looks like wasn't capable of NPCs. Make it here to be with us today. I must have just missed them. Perhaps you would accept the award on their behalf. After all, you've been so kind to so many here at the Dream Festival. So now. I hereby present the Million Dreams Award as a token of how much you matter to us. Congratulations! Because, like, it's a big open space and she doesn't see them, so it kind of implies that there's a crowd we don't see. We've created something special. An ice cream flavor just for you. Royal Berry Ice Cream! Oh my, I wish I had my own ice cream flavor. What's it taste like? Go on, try it! So you can always share it with everyone. Just pop off a piece of the cone and scoop ice cream on it and pass it out. What do you think? Delicious. You couldn't have picked a better flavor. Oh, we're all very glad you're enjoying it. No. Who does she think she is to be in a place like this? Where is he? Just bust out of here and Where did you put him, the void? You do not possess that kind of power. Who's there? Show yourself. That is enough. Stop your sniveling and heed my words. Um, okay. If you do exactly as I say, I may decide to release you from this prison. Really? Oh, then you can count on me. Just get me out of here, and you can tell me what to do. A very wise choice indeed. Proceed. It's kind of a harsh punishment for just annoying. being annoying. Soon, every world in existence will Annoying at festival games. You are sent into the void. 
as punishment. Gee, Minnie, why don't you just send him to the gallows? Dang. Unlock the command board for Disneytown. Dream Festival is a wealth of wonderful attractions. Yeah. 